The TVA is not an SCP. But if it were, how would the SCP Foundation contain it? Hello, I'm Dr. Theron Sherman, and in this series we construct hypothetical containment procedures for non-SCP popular culture entities and objects. Before we begin, today's episode is brought to you by the Site42 Patreon. Head to the link in our bio to get early access to Site42 videos and other perks. And as always, support independent artists. Now, let's get started. Spoilers for all of Season 1 of Loki. The Time Variance Authority is the kind of bureaucratic, authoritarian shadow organization that the Foundation can really get along with. There are probably multiple realities where the TVA and SCP Foundation simply work together. But in case things don't go smooth, and let's face it, it never goes smooth, let's look at other ways the Foundation has dealt with, essentially, itself. In SCP-4755, the Foundation, 100 years from now, has become so evolved that it has ascended to a non-conceptual form of existence and is literally containing its past self, us. In SCP-4839, the Administrator from one of the alternate realities becomes so obsessed with containing things that they attempt to contain literally everything. SCP-1322 is a wild ride where we find a wormhole to an alternate dimension with an alternate Foundation, but while things go well in the beginning, trading technology and things like that, one of our harmless flu viruses decimates their global population, and the vaccine we send them to cure it sterilizes the rest of them. So they start sending nuclear weapons through the wormhole for revenge. And in my personal favorite example, SCP-4052 is the story of the time the Foundation went head-to-head -head with, I kid you not, the Sandwich Police, or as they call themselves, Sandwich Cataclysm Prevention. If you bring anything resembling a sandwich into the city of Sandwich, Illinois, an extra-dimensional officer will materialize, ask to see your sandwich license, and since who has one of those, he takes your sandwich to his sandwich police car and disappears. Apparently, sandwiches somehow cause cataclysms in their dimension, and we eventually reach an agreement with them to stop testing and blowing up their home. With sandwiches. So, with all of this research, how would we contain the TVA? It's actually very simple, and would progress almost identically to the plot of the Loki series. First, we need to encounter the TVA. That's easy. The Foundation is probably responsible for a fairly high amount of branching timelines on their own. Once we've encountered a group of TVA hunters, the question is, can we stop them from purging our timeline long enough to procure one of their temp pads? And since they seemingly only come armed with their purging sticks and the purge grenade, I believe our mobile task forces, or even one agent armed with a gun, would do fine enough at this step. Once we've engaged the TVA, we covertly research their archives to discover the void at the end of time. After pruning several D-Class and tracking them using chronometers to make sure it works, we'd send our agents into the void. Here we have Eliath, a daunting threat to be sure, but if two Loki variants are enough to enchant the entity, so too can any multitude of memetics or cognitohazards we have lying around. Hell, maybe we'll just toss the procrastination rock into it, and it will put off eating us and open the way to our final destination, the Citadel at the end of time. And when we face Immortus or Kang or whatever he's calling himself, what does the Foundation do from there? Obviously, we take his deal, take over the TVA, and run the show ourselves. Hey, look at me. Look at me. I'm the TVA now. Also, just an extra thought. If you change the names around with the Loki plot a little, there is a prime foundation who's maintaining normalcy and protecting their universe from being ZK'd by ZKing every branch in the timeline and alternate foundation is a solid 001 proposal. I wouldn't be shocked if we already have an article or tale like that and I simply don't know about it. Make sure to like and share this video, comment any creatures you would like to see containment procedures implemented for, and if you want to help us make bigger and better SCP projects, become a patron at the link in the description. Secure. Contain. Protect.